So, anyways, this is the, the smallest bit, and then I believe this is the right size, so I'm going to do the small one first, center mass. Show you where I did it. And the bolts like that. Sorry for the weird camera angles and shit. So goes through both. That was the small bit, so just a sec. And then this is the the one I believe should be the right one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on the smaller hole and make it a little bit bigger. As you can see, it's a little bit bigger. Yeah, well, I mean, get, get down to at least halfway. It's on both sides, so. And then here's the, the next biggest bolt. So, like, it's only a little bit bigger. But sorry if you hear any background noise. biggest one and it should fit the pin so, just a little bit bigger but here's the here's the hood pin but there's a problem is this it's almost there and the, the threading won't, won't fit in so I might have to make it a little bit bigger and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just guesstimate the best I can do. I'm just going to say screw it. And go ahead and drill it with the big bit on this side so I can get it through. And then just like the other side, it fits right through. Clean it off a little bit. So, because they both don't, both the hood pins don't fit in it, because it needs to be just a little bit wider. So, yep, so I found the, the right size. This one's just bigger. So, hopefully, the, the pin will fit right in. Here we go again.
So now I'm gonna go get the pin, see if it works. And then anyways, you take the hood pin and you start screwing it on one side. In my opinion, you should probably give it enough fucking room so it actually works. <laughs> and then put it on. Put something like that. It gets put on like that anyway. You have to make it go down further so you can at least get it flat on the bottom and I'll show you once I get it on. Pull it up. And then as you do it, I'm gonna have to turn turn that like the way I want it, but anyways like that. God damn, it's a fucking bitch getting down in here. And you should see that much space. So anyways, I made it so it looks, so it's facing this way. So, because I don't want it like some weird, bleebly, jeebly looking fucking thing. You, you get what I'm saying. And then I'm going to, then I'm going to do it on this side too. And I'll show you again and it'll look a lot better. So anyways, here's the, well, just so I can see what it's like. And then... Putting, putting this side on. And fuck it. You know, just make sure you get a decent amount. And you should be able to see it a lot better because that the battery was kind of pissing me off. So you couldn't see jack shit. And then you put that one on the bottom. But yeah, you know, this would be a pain in the ass. Oh, hold on a second. Out first. And then I got it in, but anyway, so it's like that. And then take it under. If you ever have to, you can always say, fuck that bolt for now. And then move this bolt over, like, over what you need. And make sure it's down. Like, it goes down all the way. Try to avoid hitting anything, because you don't want to fucking bust something open and fuck your truck up, bro. Make sure it's flat. It's flat. And pull that son of a bitch up as far as you can. No, it's fucking level. It might move a little bit, but make sure it's good. Hold it in place. And there's that. And then just a sec. Here's the pin though you put it in so it goes past that gap so so then there's these things that go on top of the hood they just slide right on top and it does that and then I mean look at how small and ridiculous these, these fucking screws are though like I have to bring them really close so you can barely see them but then they go on this on the four holes on top of the hood So as of right now, they look like that. So then the next part is I'll show you how they they go through the hood and how to screw them through the hood so they're perfect. Well, so anyways, so bolt these these bolts. You, you want to make that one was flush. That's why I did that. You want to make sure you tighten that one down like a a mother though. So I mean, you want to make it really tight. So anyways, 
It's an 11 16 wrench. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to tighten, tighten the hell out of it. So it's solid, so it doesn't move when it goes, when, when it's through the hood. It's almost there, so it's pulling it through. So I'm just going to show you doing the front right side. I'm basically going to do the same thing to the other side, but there's probably no point in wasting anybody's time to show you both sides so you got to do it until it's really tight which it's almost there basically until you can't turn up As you can see, I can I can barely. That's real itch to move though. So there's that. So anyways, I made a mark right here on that side, like for that one, and then. Mark right there, and I'm about to drill it with the drill. So anyways, this is where I'm going to take a small drill bit again and make it so the whole top of the hood, uh, the hood pin pops up. And then right here is the other one, so I'm just about to do that. So, okay, so now I got a small bit, and then I'm going to drill this, but you got to show it, Dad. Mm-hmm. Mm. I got it a little bit. Mm, come on, drill it. Okay. That'll be enough. Yep, and then come on this side. Yep. Right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it moved. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Tell him how it's gonna move. Okay. All right, now try it. Okay. Go back over here and drill that one. 